Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Clash Royale and today I'm back on the random deck series. Hopefully today I can finally reach Arena 5. I mean I'm getting fairly close. I think I'm probably like two or three games away. So hopefully I can get to that. I think before we do that I just need to claim everything. So I've got a brand new season on the season pass. And since I've last played, they've completely redone all of the pass thing. Like It's now more like um, Fortnite's pass, where obviously you only get certain items for the free one. And then the other one, you get all the items. So rather than having two on each one, it's sort of like that. Okay, so I can actually open a banner box as well because I started logging on to this account every day just to collect some stuff. So yeah, Elixir Arena, I'm not going to lie, that actually looks really nice. I wonder if that was one of like the higher chance, like the lower chance ones of getting it. But yeah, that does actually look really nice, I'm going to be honest. But I don't know what I put it with, so it's like, I think I'll just leave it as it is for now because I haven't really got anything that would go with it there. So let's just collect my free thing from here. And yeah, let's do the first randomized deck. I wonder if they put it into... No, they haven't put it into that one yet. It's honestly the most annoying thing ever to try and um, get it across to the normal deck. I don't know why they've changed it. Okay, so we've got this deck. Not looking too bad. Let's just upgrade the Battle Ram and the Valkyrie. And let's see, what are the other levels looking like? couple of sevens and stuff do you know what maybe i might upgrade the cannon might be wanting that to be higher oh, i don't actually have enough wild cards for that so i think for now i'll just leave it but yeah not a too bad a deck i think i could probably do decent with this so yeah let's get straight into the first game and to be honest i think looking at this deck i will probably win this game i don't want to sound like too cocky or confident but obviously i'm fairly used to the game so it sort of would make sense for me to win if you know what I mean okay that wasn't the best play I'm gonna be honest I messed that up badly there level 4 wizard I thought I was gonna one shot it I'm gonna be honest I fully thought that was going to one shot the wizard that barbarian might get a bit of damage. Okay, it's fine. Didn't have my cannon cycle. It's all good. Didn't know they did hog riders this low. Oh well. Okay. Okay, so he's playing down the mini P.E.K.K.A again. That Valkyrie should get decent damage on it, and then my Mega Minion should finish it off. See what he plays, maybe if he plays Wizard. Oh, I wasn't expecting him to play that, I'm going to be honest. Let's try and spread the Spear Goblins out. Okay, not really what I was hoping for, I'm going to be honest. Let's just play the Knight at the back. Wait, that doesn't stop it. Nah, you're joking. So if you're wondering why I said that doesn't stop it, it's because obviously the log normally stops the prince. So I was fully expecting that to just take it out. And obviously it didn't. So, yeah. I should still be able to take that tower though. Just fireball that. Okay, so it is one shot. But to be fair, so is mine. So, you know. Not the best. Let's just try and get some damage on that. They're fighting so hard, but I can just fireball it. So, you know. Then I will. Can I have black current, please? Okay, so it's looking not too bad at the moment. 
I mean, I've almost taken his other tower as well. So yeah, looking really good. And I don't know why he's playing Skeleton Army there, because obviously that's his main defence against my uh, Barbarian Barrel, so... Not his best play. And then... Should be looking fairly good from here. Okay, and then let's just go full charge. See what he does. Boom, got that on. And now it's just a matter of time before his tower's mine. And that's his tower right there. Boom. And that's the first game done. That's a lot closer than I would have liked. Mainly because of that prince plan, I'm going to be honest. I fully expected it to knock the prince back, but obviously it doesn't for some reason. I don't know why. But yeah, that's the first game done. Just need to win my next one, and I am in Arena 5, which is, you know, fairly good for the series. What's this? So the Cannon Mastery. Nice. Okay, so... Let's do the next randomized deck. Oh, this doesn't look like this doesn't look too bad. Gonna be honest. Okay, so you got Prince, which this is the first time I've using it. You can tell because obviously it's only level six. But yeah, let's get that bad boy up. Be doing some decent stuff with that. Minions can get them up. Okay, so just looking at this deck, it's fairly attack focused. Like, you've got, obviously, you've got Prince, Giant, then I suppose you've also got decent defences. The only thing it might struggle with is air defence. I don't know, we'll see. Like, Baby Dragon could cause some issues with this deck. But, yeah, you know, I reckon I can probably do decent with it. So, yeah, let's get into the next game. Hopefully, I can reach Arena 5. Obviously, it's really weird for me, because seeing that icon, back when I first started playing the game, this was Arena 5. Like this um, background arena, and obviously back when I first started playing, it was Pekka's Playhouse. Was um, and I completely messed that. Pekka's Playhouse was Arena Four, so you know, for me, it is very weird seeing this. Like very weird. That was a really nice Inferno Tower. See what he plays. Just play Prince on the other side, just because why not? Ooh. Wasn't expecting that. Should have saved my bar barrel. It's fine, still got a hit on the tower. I suppose that's all that matters for now. Just getting hits on the tower, that's all we need. Hit every now and then. Okay, so I reckon let's just start like a full giant play at the back. See what he does. I mean, he's not playing anything at the moment, so... Why is he just doing that? Obviously he's going to be wasting Alexa. Like... Is he just letting me win? Don't know why, but you know, just letting me win. But hey, I'll take it. And yeah, I mean, that's probably the easiest one I've had so far, and I'm pretty sure that should be now Marina 5. So, yeah. Get all six crowns as well. That's another thing that's really weird to me. Like, you get all of the crowns, like, for any towers you've still got as well. So yeah, Arena 5, Builder's Workshop, which, like I said, back in the day, this used to be Arena 6. And yeah, Pekka's Playhouse used to be Arena 4. So yeah, we're in Arena 6. I think I'll play one game, you know, first game of Arena 6. And then, yeah, unlocked a new card. The flying machine, which is actually not a bad card if you know how to use it. So yeah, next randomized deck. Isn't looking too bad. Okay, so got the fire spirit, first time using that. 
Damn, I'm getting loads of messages at the moment. Okay, so. Getting that up to level 7, and everything else in this deck is level 7. Yeah, nice. Okay, so. I'm also level 19. Fairly good. Guess grab my level up chest. See, can we get anything? Got bats now, mortar, lightning. I mean, lightning is fairly good. Bats are alright. Again, if you know how to use it, mortar is kind of trash. Like, expo is much better if you're going to use a card like that. But yeah, let's get into the next game and see if I can solidify myself in Arena Six, in Arena Five. Like I said, very confusing to me because this was Arena Six. I didn't really look at the deck as well. I just realised. But yeah, I got Tombstone. That could be useful. Getting something like a Hog Rider or something. Let's check. It is still recording. Yeah, it's still recording. Bang the wizard in behind that. That's one thing I did notice. No one's got like any levels on their wizard at all. Like I was noticing that um, most people with their wi with their wizard, it would be like level three, level four. And that's his first tower gone, just like that. And this is where the tombstone comes into play. Two things that don't really work well with the tombstone. Okay. And yeah, that absolutely annihilated his defense. So let's try and do it again. Other side. So start with that. Get the wizard in behind him. Honestly, giant wizard, such a good combo. Like such a good combo. Like it just absolutely takes out everything. Like the wizard does so much damage, and the giant's got such good health that you can just tank almost anything. And obviously, the giant's biggest weakness is swarm units. Okay, so that's that. Again, tombstone there. Deal with their giant. Start my own giant push. Again, tombstone, perfect defense against the giant. So, yeah. I'll play down that knight just because um, I love the way he just... That has got to be the dumbest mini pecker I think I've ever seen in my entire life. He literally played it right on top of the one thing that the mini pecker is weak to. I can just all out push, double giant now. Like, you know, double wizard. He ain't gonna have a chance. And yeah, that's pretty much gonna be his tower. And just like that, I've solidified myself in Arena 5. So, yeah, again, I'm on a massive game winning streak, like... I reckon if you looked back through the previous couple videos, I reckon I've been on a winning streak since about Arena 3, I'm pretty sure. That's the only game I've lost, so... Yeah, at the moment I'm completely unbeatable. Unlocked the Tombstone card mastery as well. Got some more gold, can always do some gold on this account. That's one thing, because like I said, I've been logging on every day, I've got plenty of gold at the moment. So... Yeah, that's going to be the end of this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you on Clash Royale or any other games that I see on this channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys on in the next one.